New at 5 o'clock, a Special Operations Marine received a Navy Cross today at Camp Pendleton for his actions in Afghanistan. Five others earned bronze stars. 10 News reporter Hannah Mullins explains what he did to earn the second highest award for heroism. It's not uncommon to hear the term hero, but Gunnery Sergeant Brian Jacklin sure seems to raise the bar. Let us pray. When it seems that hell itself has broken loose, that's what happened three years ago in Afghanistan. Enemies surrounded the team and launched hails of gunfire. Most would run, but these are Marines. I was on the rooftop and then I was shot and uh, slumped over and realized I was paralyzed. Derek Carrera was the company commander. When he went down, gunnery sergeant Brian Jacklin took control, but the only way out the building was through the gunfire. I asked the guys, I said, look, does anyone have a problem? With, uh, with risking it to take these guys out there, because if we don't, they're, they're going to die here. And uh, there wasn't a second hesitation. Everyone says, I'm, I'm in, let's do it. They blew a hole through the wall, then used their bodies as shields to get Herrera and the other injured sergeant to the aircraft. Jacqueline stayed back for a 48-hour gun battle, and that's why he earned the Navy Cross. Jacqueline is a humble hero. He thanked the families and gave credit to his Marine brothers who received bronze stars, as well as the air crews. You are and always will be the guardian angels of the man on the ground. I'm here today because of the actions that these men did and the heroism and the, 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 the courage that they displayed on the battlefield. Is there any other option? There wasn't because Jacqueline is a Marine. That's what Marines do. We don't, we don't retreat. Hell itself must bend its knee when courage prevails and good men respond with greatness. Hannah Mullins, Amen. 10 News.